this video is about a possible devil's bargain in the conclusion of the Forest Fen treasure chase. This video is recorded on 16 June 2021. It is not legal advice, it is not intended to be legal advice, and it should not be taken in that context. This video is merely commentary and is strictly in my opinion. Firstly, the definition of a devil's bargain. According to UrbanDictionary.com, it is an extremely bad deal with a terrible price to pay, which someone considers accepting because they can see no other way out of a truly horrible situation. In this respect, this may be the dilemma that Forrest Fenn has faced at the conclusion of the treasure chase. This is an outline of the possible dilemma which Forrest faced in the end. First option, to release the full solution hint by hint, location by location. The treasure hiding spot would be identified by GPS coordinates. Forrest would likely achieve a level of fame. His legacy would be largely intact. Searches for the treasure would have closure. Elements of genius may well be revealed in the construction of the treasure chase and in the manner in which the book and the clues were concealed. And forest collaborators can take a bow for their contribution. But the downside is the entire Forest Fen estate may be in jeopardy. That is, there may be nothing to distribute to family after the consequences of revealing the treasure location. Second option, where Forest decides that the Forest Fen estate and his financial wealth will remain largely intact. The downside is the solution and the location are never disclosed. Searches have no closure. There is limited fame for Forrest. Forrest's legacy is largely compromised. Any elements of genius in the treasure chase will remain largely obscured and there is no acknowledgement for forest collaborators. Part of the reason why the solution may never be known is the statute of limitations in Wyoming. According to Wikipedia, both misdemeanors and felonies have no statute of limitations in Wyoming. To the extent that may influence the release of the solution or the treasure location, that may be a problem which can never be overcome. I'm sorry that I haven't disclosed the basis on which the disclosure of the treasure location may cause difficulties for the Forest Fen estate. However, I don't believe it is my job to do that. I speculate that Jack, the finder of the treasure chest, may actually already be subject to a legal gag or confidentiality agreement limiting his opportunity to disclose the solve, the solution or the treasure location. If the chase was essentially about the price of fame and how much it may cost Forrest to achieve fame, then you may find that the universe actually up the stakes in Forrest's game of poker. That is, Forrest needed to go all in and choose between fame or fortune. It seems to me that Forrest believed that some things were too steep a price to pay. 
having regard to the apparent meaning of the double omegas set out in my other video, which may or may not have been released at the date of this video. It may be somewhat poetic that Forrest is actually faced with a choice between fame or fortune. Finally, if there is a solver other than Jack, and there is that possibility, I don't discount it, there is likely to be a situation where the solver receives no acknowledgement, no credit, and certainly no reward. However, the solver may have already resigned themselves to the fact that there will be nothing in the treasure chase for them. And lastly, if anyone is going out into the wilderness searching for remnants of the Forest Fen treasure, Please take care of your safety.